So many new details about the attack on the compound. The mission, called Operation Neptune Spear, definitively a kill mission. In Abbottabad on Sunday, one SEAL team climbed to the third floor of the Bin Laden house and came face to face with America's public enemy number one. But today we learned that Osama Bin Laden was not armed. If he A director Leon Panetta told the PBS NewsHour that Bin Laden was not shooting back as the 25-man assault team attacked the compound. When they got up there, there were some threatening moves that were made that uh, clearly represented uh, a clear threat to our guys, and uh, that's the reason they fired. This, of course, was not some poor defenseless man. He was a mass murderer who, for all anyone knew, was wearing a suicide vest. And it was not as if they were welcomed with tea. The resistance was consistent from the moment they landed to the, till the end of the operation. Back at the White House, the president and his team were monitoring the events in real time. This photograph so vividly capturing the tension on Secretary of State Hillary Clinton's face. Panetta at CIA headquarters was on a corner of the screen, explaining to the president and his team what they were watching. But when the SEALs were inside, the president and his team had no idea what was going on, and it was nerve-wracking. Commander of Special Operations in Afghanistan, Vice Admiral McRaven heard one of the SEALs say, Geronimo, the code for the capture or killing of bin Laden. Today, we also learned from the CIA that intelligence was only 60 to 80 percent sure that bin Laden was in this Pakistani enclave. But officials said the information was the most solid.